The running youths got out and ran in the second half, and they get the victory 55-50 over the visiting Fresno State Bulldogs. Craig Smith and company running their record to 8-4. and four. Todd Harris, Coach Ernie Kent, Lahat Chun doing a masterful job tonight, not only on the defensive side, Coach, but kicking in with 10 points. I thought he filled in quite nicely with Carson not being able to play the game. He did a good job of just stepping up and playing well and holding down the middle. No question about it. Orlando Robinson on the other side for the Fresno State Bulldogs. But really the story of this game, Utah's ability to hit the three in the second half. Well, they got rolling in the second half, and they started finding themselves. And what I mean by that is the drive, kick, putting Fresno State in rotation, created a lot of open looks, and they step up and hit a lot of threes. Five or ten threes in the second half. Big difference in the game. No question about it. This young man, it's a good sight when he gets going if you're a Utah fan. David Jenkins, Jr., it took the second half for him to get his points going. But I'll tell you what, contributions a little bit from everyone helped the cause. Anthony's game was big. Worcester hit some big threes as well. Stavanovich played as well. I thought this team did a nice job of redefining themselves throughout their injuries that they had in this ball game. Now they can go to the break with a little momentum, relax, have a great Christmas, come back and get ready for conference play. Utah now at 8-4. and four. Next up for them, Oregon State and Oregon. For head coach Ernie Ken, I'm Todd Harris saying good night from Salt Lake City.